Today we're going to be brutally ranking YouTuber products. I'm also joined by Grace, if you don't know who she is, she's my co-worker at Her Street. Co-worker? Co-worker. Co-worker is harsh. We're going to be ranking these products from 1 to 5, 1 being the best, 5 being the worst. Today we're going to be ranking 5 YouTuber products. We're going to be adding different categories, so each category will be scored out of 5 points. The packaging is worth 5 points. Just overall. Just overall, we have an additional 5 points. Start us off, we've got Prime Hydration Strawberry Watermelon Flavor. We put this in the fridge for 24 hours because online reviews say it's better when it's cold. So, do you want to go first or do you want me to go first? So, starting us off with the packaging, obviously that they have all different colors, but I like pink, so that's a good start. And for like a hydration bottle, I like how it's like, got the grooves, it fits in your hand nicely. It's half a liter. Um, yeah, packaging looks nice. No, it looks really good on the outside. Um, Prime, if you're listening. They're not the same. Sponsor. So we're gonna, I don't know if you can hear this, bro. I don't sound like anything. Ooh, that was a nice little pop. It's just a cat. I guess we're under the taste test right now. We've never actually had the strawberry watermelon flavor. You wanna go first, or? I don't look at my face, because it'll give away if I like it. I don't like Prime, but I like that flavor. It's giving a little bit like medicine, but out of all the Prime that I've had, I actually do rate that one. I don't know. I don't know. Is that medicine? It's actually quite nice. Doesn't really taste like strawberry or watermelon at all. I wouldn't drink it every single day. I would have one every now and then. I'd choose that over a powder. Yeah, it tastes nice. I like it. So, Grace, we'll start with your score. Out of five, presentation wise, what do you say? As a marketing student, like just the vibes of it, I'd probably give it a four. And then taste. 3.5. Out of five. I think it's a five out of five packaging. Taste wise, I do think it's a three out of five. That's prime hydration done. <laughs> On to feastables. So for feastables, we have two flavors. We have these nuts, and we also have milk chocolate. I'm very excited for the milk chocolate one. I heard good reviews for both of them. And these nuts should actually be quite nice as well, but it is peanut butter. I'm not a big fan of peanut butter. I love peanut butter. But hopefully they're quite nice. Which one do you want to taste first? Can we do the milk first? Uh, let's first let's look at the packaging overall. So there's seven ingredients into this one, five in that one. Packaging for me, I don't know, maybe a free for packaging again for me, for both of them. Grace? I'd say overall for like the whole Feastables like brand, I rate their packaging. I think it's quite smart in like their colour choices. I'd go like a four and a half packaging. It's better, I think it's better than brands. This is kind of more of a lighter colour to the one that Grace has there. It has share and devour on the bottom. Alright, so we're going to do the milk chocolate first. Tasting it now. Three, two, one. That's actually really good. That's quite nice. It's not that sweet. It's not as sweet as like a dairy milk, but it tastes like actual chocolate. That's a four out of five for me for taste wise, that one. It was very basic though. Like. We'll see how this one tastes though. Like. Yeah, like peanut butter. Alright, onto the D's Nuts one now. Let's give it a try. Personally, not a fan at all. I just don't like peanut butter, so it's going to be a one for me. I do like that, but I wish, like, in the picture, it was more like a Can eat some water. gooey peanut butter than, like, I don't know what this is, like a crisp. So, I like that, actually. I think total that. for me would be a five out of ten. Grace, what's yours? Seven. All right, next one now, on to the no two ways. Had these shipped all the way from London. Um, cost is an arm and a leg to get here in Australia. Probably the only pair in Australia. What we're going to do now, I'm going to be wearing these the whole day and then testing the durability for one day's wear and showing you the final results. But before we do that, let's rate the packaging for this so far. The no two ways look sick. They look really, really cool. Um, Calyx has smashed this one. Um, we're going to use a size 10. I am size 10. For those who are out there wanting to send me some free no two ways. Um, packaging wise, this is a 5 out of 5 for me. I like even on the paper how it has no two ways. The box is class. The box is sick how it has no two ways. Logo there. Um, I like the packaging. I think it's very basic. I'm percent recycled. I also love these shoes. I think they'll be, well, this colorway anyway would be a great basic or like a staple in your wardrobe. Obviously, if they weren't a size 10 and a size 6, I'd love to wear them, but they're not, so. So yeah, what I'm gonna be doing today is wearing them the whole day. It's currently 10 a.m. in the morning. I'm gonna be wearing these until 6 p.m. tonight. 
So, Grace, give us a score out of five for the packaging. I'll give it a five out of five. I think it looks sick. I would give it a four. Give nothing, it a four? Nothing special, but it's nice. All right. So this is where Grace is done for now. I'll bring her back in a few minutes when we need prime energy. Let's try these on. So the notes we raise are on feet right now. Super comfy shoe. Um, they look really nice as well. We're gonna be wearing them the whole day and see how they turn out after wearing them for six hours plus. See you then. All right, so we're finally on to the final product of the day, Prime Energy Drink. We've got the blue raspberry flavor right here. Personally, I prefer the energy drinks to the hydration. Let's rate Prime Energy and see how it tastes. So packaging start straight away. Obviously on the blue bottle here, this blue raspberry with a black top and this silver bottom. I just think the whole kind of vibe blends together with the energy and hydration. I think it works well. I like it. You like it? Pretty basic. So out of, out of five, what do you make? What do you reckon out of five? Four. I think four as well. So four and four for the. Uh, I think that's the first time I've actually agreed with anything. <laughs> Maybe. So let's get to tasting it. What I want to do first, I don't know if you guys can see, but ready. <laughs> Alright, so Grace, go ahead, go ahead and try it first, Tell, let me know what you think, okay. let everyone at home know what you think, Alright. and see how we go with it. It's not that bad, I actually like it. It doesn't taste like it. I'm not going to drink anymore because it's caffeinated, but... That is actually quite nice. Honestly? It's nice. For energy. I'm not a fruit critic, critic and I don't really... There's a reason I don't get reviews on this sort of stuff, and I see, see the football videos, but I think it's a 4 out of... Four out of five again, so it can give me an eight out of ten overall. Grace? I, I give it about the same. I think it's a four. Yeah. I was always gonna say four point five, but because you said four, I'm gonna go four. Now to show you how the no two ways have held up after wearing them all day. I'm excited for this one. Alright, as you can see the no two ways are on feet. Um proper comfy. Been wearing them all day, and you can see it on the bottom of them. A lot of the belly being worn. What I do like about it on the bottom, how it has the no two way in the middle of the shoe. I just think it's a pretty cool way to advertise the brand name. And on the tongue piece as well. Yeah, very much a summer shoe. I'm going to be wearing these all the time now. Definitely my new and you go to shoes. Only thing is, to get them to Australia, a little bit expensive. I personally give these a 5 out of 5, and a 5 out of 5 again. This is a bang, definitely my, no, my new go-to pair of shoes. I don't know if you can play football in them, but we're going to test that out in a further video. But what you're going to see now, I'm going to mine individually, then Grace will rank hers individually. It's going to be very interesting. Okay, I'm going to rank them. Um, I'm just going to pretend that these were my size and that I could wear them where I would put them. So Prime first, mainly just this flavour. Peanut Butter Feastables, No Two Ways, Prime Energy, Milk Chocolate Feastables. Alright, so my order is going to be a little bit different to Grace's straight away. So first of all, you guys already know, that's not gonna be there. That's not gonna be there. Yeah, no two ways. I think it's a number one. Um, just a nice looking silhouette for a pair of shoes. One being the no two ways. Prime Energy coming in at number two. Feastables, Mr. B's chocolate bar. Milk chocolate edition is banger at number three. Uh, the strawberry watermelon favored prime hydration. Number four, I don't know, it's just not my cup of tea. And then number five, Mr. Beast, these nuts. All right guys, that's the whole video done and dusted. I know it's a bit of a different one, it's not a football related video, but it's something new. On this channel, I'm gonna do a bit of, bit of everything really. So smash that like button if you're new around here, subscribe, we're so close to 500 subscribers. We're gonna hit it soon. Uh, big thanks to the Grace for coming down, her link will be in the description below. And I'll see you a lot next time. Peace. I'm gonna eat the rest of this. <laughs>